message box buttons don't work. I'm using this Windows API to create a message box on screen, but for some reason, the buttons don't work. Here's my code. I don't understand why you're doing it like that, and Linux may have a much easier way of doing it. Why even use Windows? Linux is far superior in every way possible. First of all, it is open source. And what is it like when you buy a car but you cannot see what- Part 2 How to stop the recursion limit in Python? Hello, is it possible to stop the recursion limit in Python? I want to calculate the value very accurately, but it's giving me a recursion depth limit. Python, really? Do you have no respect for yourself? Why would you use a kid's programming language? <laughs> You're surely such a moron. Real programmers use C or C++, not Python. Are you actually kidding me? Like, what is wrong with you? Just go you scratch at this point. How to create a class with C++? Hello, can anyone help me with creating a class in C++? I don't know how to do that. I use Python. How to convert a string to a char array in C++? I need to use CCTR and nothing else. My employer only allows that. Yeah, man, just use str copy. Why would I do that? That isn't CSDR. Yeah, uh, nobody does CSDR. How do I convert a string in C sharp? I have an integer I want to convert to a string. How can I do that? Um, try using C++. Um, converting the string isn't really a best practice. I recommend you use a shirt instead of an int. Duplicate of how to convert the int in Rust, actually. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. This video was suggested so much that I couldn't let you all down and not make one. I will still upload videos like this regularly, but I expect more content such as devlogs of things I'm working on. Overall, I will be far more active. I will be streaming quite a lot as well, so expect more of that. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. Zaibgai out.